I asked Mr. Franklin about what led him to shoot Larry Flint, and here's what he told me. I looked on the coffee table, and there was a, a Hustler magazine on it, you know. So I'd seen it before in Atlanta, but I didn't really know that much about it. So I'd seen it was a girl play magazine. I picked it up and started, you know, thumbing through it. And then I see this picture of some broad having sex with a black, you know. Uh -huh. And I got so outraged, I closed the book up, closed the magazine up, set it on the uh, back on the coffee table and thought to myself, I'm going to kill that guy. Watching the news and it said Larry Flint was in town. So all I had to do was stay at a motel there in Atlanta and I could go out there for the trial every day, which I did, just looking around, trying to case the whole area, you know, case the uh, streets there, you know, trying to find a good place to ambush him, you know. But Larry Flint used to go down to this cafeteria every day and eat lunch. They have to, the reporter happened to mention that. I thought, oh, yeah, good. So I, I went and found that cafeteria and walked that path, you know, from the courthouse to the cafeteria uh -huh. one evening and, you know, just looking, trying to visualize a good place for sniping. So as luck would have it, there was an empty building there. And so I went over there and I saw the building, uh, went over there. It was so old and run down, there wasn't even any windows there, just a you know, blank spaces, so I crawled in the window one night and looked around, and, and sure enough, it was a good place for an ambush. I could just shoot out the back of the front door. So that's how I, you know, wound up uh, uh, shooting Larry Flynn. 